I have just been released from jail and time is running out. I must make it to Sapporo, the capital of Hokkaido, to make my visa. If I am lucky enough, this city will be my key to Russia. It's really different from the rest of Japan. You don't have these bamboos everywhere. Nonetheless, it's really beautiful. Sapporo is no small city. Not too big either. Impression-wise, it feels like Beijing. Although, according to Wikipedia, the Chinese city is 10 times bigger. I've been to the embassy, asked for the visa. Now, let's just go to Russia and let's go through the Kuril Islands. Hello, Konnichiwa! He is a very kind person who drove me all the way. And I am now approaching the most eastern point of my trip. Look here, there is an island in front of me. That is already Russia. Kamchatka lies ahead. There is Yushno Kurils. May 25th, 2014. I have arrived at Cape Nemuro. I can see Russia ahead, but no way to get there, unfortunately. The way to the Kuril Islands is pretty much close to foreigners. There are several options open to me. Posing as a fake journalist or a scientist, they have a special permission to enter the Kuril Islands. Or, I could enter illegally on a fishing boat. Word goes that Russians are opening fire on Japanese fishing boats. I don't want to get shot again. And even if I succeed, then what? Would I be stuck on the first island? How the hell would I make it to mainland Russia? And the sea seems so evil. I really do not like that plan so unlikely to succeed. So I turn back, I return to Sapporo. I will try something else. I'm standing in front of the headquarters of the Heart and Land Ferry to Sakhalin and I am going to try to find the president of the company and hitchhike it. I don't think it will work but uh, wish me good luck. Yes, you heard right. I am going to the CEO of this company to hitchhike their boat. But all this might be confusing without a crash course in geography. So here we go. The island I am now on is called Hokkaido. It is without any doubt Japanese territory. And in case you haven't noticed, all around Hokkaido there is only Russia. The islands I try to get to on the eastern side are called the Kuril Islands. There are a bunch of sparsely inhabited islands and 
they are disputed territory. Japan thinks they are Japan, Russia thinks they are Russia. On the northern side there is Sakhalin. It is also an island and it is also Russia, even according to some Japanese. And miracle there, there is a ferry going there. Sometimes. Actually only in June and August. But guess what? June will be here shortly and that's, that's my chance to cross. I have written a three-page letter explaining my hitchhiking trip. It states that I have now traveled through 18 countries, spending exactly nothing for transport. And I need a ticket for free. A copy of that letter has been posted on the company's Facebook page and I have received support from all over the world. In a few moments now, the CEO is going to receive me. Oh, uh, Konnichiwa, uh, it's your favorite crazy person. Okay, uh, I am now in the office and I was talking with some guy from the board of directors. I am actually talking to the board of directors, so there is small chance. You get a uh, Russian visa? Yeah. From uh, 29th to 17th, so... Uh, 17th January, okay. Okay. May I copy? Mm -hmm. And this is your uh, boarding ticket from Wakanai to Kozako one-way ticket. Oh, and the class is uh, second. It's and uh, yeah. Free of charge. Damn cool. <laughs> I have the ticket. What the fuck just happened? It feels unreal. The Harkland Ferry, that Japanese company that I pretty much expected to kick me out, gave me not one, but two tickets. I've got the one to Russia, but they gave me another one. The company suggested that before I leave Japan, I should visit Mount Rishiri, a mysterious Japanese island, the lonely mountain in the sea. And of course, they will get me to there for free. We tend to forget about this. But truly, given enough kind people, everything becomes possible. I am on the top of Mount Rishiri. It's a mountain in the middle of the sea. And it looks like this. This in front of me is the island of Rebo. And this is and tomorrow I am going to Russia. Television got me. You know what? Fuck it. I am a sellout. Ooh.